I've been told it's a good idea to start a speech with a joke. Well, don't get your hopes up. I'm not here to tell jokes. I'm here to pick a fight. I'm here to pick a fight with second place. I have about as much patience for second place as I do for flies in my soup. But maybe you like flies in your soup. Maybe you like second place. Maybe you like that you gave it your best better luck next time, malarkey. They spoon feed runner ups. Let me put it another way. If you think second place ain't such a bad deal, why don't you ask Napoleon how he felt about coming in second at Waterloo? Not so good. Not so good. And you can spare me, it's not whether you win or lose or how you play the game bullshit. I guarantee you whoever said that lost the game. Moral of the story, come in first. Still want to hear a joke? Fine. Here's one for you. Knock, knock. Who's there? The guy that finished second. The guy that finished second who? Exactly. Let me tell you something. If tomorrow wasn't promised, what would you give for today? Forget everything else. Forget everything else. Forget that there was any sunlight left. What would you spend today thinking about? Yourself or the man that's beside you? Or the man that you know you'd give everything in your heart for? We get one opportunity in life. One chance in life to do whatever you're going to do. To lay your foundation and to make whatever mark you're going to make. Whatever legacy you're going to leave. Leave your legacy. And it's found through effort. Wins and losses come a dime a dozen. But effort, nobody can judge effort. Because effort is between you and you. Effort ain't got nothing to do with nobody else. So that team that think they're ready to see you, that think what they seen on film, they ain't saw what film shows. Because every day is a new day. Every moment is a new moment. So now you got to go out and show them that I'm a different creature now than I was five minutes ago. Cause I'm pissed off for greatness. Cause if you ain't pissed off for greatness, that means you're okay with being mediocre. to succeed as bad as you want to breathe, then you'll be successful. <laughs>